Good morning, my dear students in grade 4. How are you today? I hope you are fine. رؤية المدرسة إعداد فتيات متعلمات مبدعات قادرات على بناء مجتمع واع متحضر محافظة على أخلاقه وقيمه ومستخدمة للتكنولوجيا الحديثة. The school vision to prepare creative, well-educated students who are able to establish civilized, aware, reserved society, stick to the authentic morals and values, in addition to using the modern technology. Our lesson today is Module 10, Health, Top Stars, Part 2. What day is it today? Today is Sunday. What is the date today? Today is the 18th of April 2021. Objectives Identify how to give advice using SHOT. Use SHOT to give advice in speaking. Use SHOT to give advice in writing. Watch the video and mention the advices in the video. I'm tired. I think you should go to bed. I think you should go to bed. You shouldn't go to the cinema. You shouldn't go to the cinema. I have a toothache. You should go to the dentist. You should go to the dentist. You shouldn't eat sweets. You shouldn't eat sweets. Let's recall what happened in the story. In the school playground, where were you yesterday, Rima? I stayed at home because I was sick. You know, a doctor visited our school yesterday. He took to us and brought a poster too. In the classroom, look, Rima, when you are sick, you should drink a lot of water. That's right, but you shouldn't share your glass with the other people. Rima, you should use a tissue when you sneeze. You should use a clean tissue every time. Then you should wash your hands with warm water and soap. Look at that cat. It's so cute. Does a cat have to use a tissue too? What should Rima drink when she is sick? She should drink a lot of water. She should drink a lot of water. What should Rima use when she sneezes? She should use a tissue when she sneezes. She should use a tissue when she sneezes. How to give advice? We use should or shouldn't. Let's look at the grammar books. You should drink some tea. He or she should visit the doctor. You shouldn't eat ice cream. He or she shouldn't go to school today. When we give advice, we use should or shouldn't. Should or shouldn't are followed by a base form of the verb. So we say she should visit the doctor. We can't say she should visiting or she should visit. Should is always followed by a base form of the verb. The verb without any addition. In the affirmative form, 
In the positive form, we use the pronouns or the subject plus should plus base form of the verb. You should study well. You should study well. Should study. Study is the base form of the verb. We use should to give advice. And the, the verb that followed should is in the base form. You should sleep early. You should sleep early. We, sh we use shot for advice. Should sleep. Should sleep. Shot is followed by a, a base form of the verb. Negative form. Negative form. We use not. Pronoun or subject plus should plus not or n apostrophe t. This is, is a short form. Shouldn't. Should not or shouldn't. Shouldn't is a short form. Plus verb in the base form. You shouldn't drink cold water. You shouldn't drink cold water. Shouldn't. To give advice. Shouldn't is the negative form of should. Shouldn't is followed by a base form of the verb. You shouldn't swim today. You shouldn't swim today. Objective 2. Objective 1. Identify how to give advice using shot. Listen to three dialogues and circle A or B. Then check your answers with a partner. 4. Listen to three dialogues and circle A or B. Then check your answers with a partner. 1. How about having a snack? Good idea. Let's have some cold lemonade and some biscuits. I love lemonade, but I've got a sore throat. Oh, then you shouldn't have any cold lemonade. You're right. How about having some warm milk and biscuits? Okay. 2. Mum, I can't go to school today. What's the matter, Jack? I just feel very bad. I think I'm sick. Oh. Can I stay in bed? I'm sorry, Jack, but we should go to the doctor. Okay, Mum. 3. I can't see Jane in the school playground. Is she at school today? No, she isn't. She's at home because she's sick. What's the matter? Is it her ear again? Has she got an earache? No, she hasn't. She's got a stomach ache. Oh, I see. Poor Jane. Four. Listen to three dialogues and circle A or B. Then check your answers with a partner. Here are the answers. Match, then ask and answer questions with your partner. Use should or shouldn't. Stomach ache, headache, sore throat. What is the matter? I have got a stomach ache. You should eat some rice soup. You shouldn't eat sweets. If you, what is the matter? I have got a headache. You should sleep. You shouldn't go out and play. Two, I have got, what is the matter? I have got a sore throat. You should drink warm tea. You shouldn't drink cold water. Make match advices with a suitable situation, then write the advice. Salim has fever. He 
Mark is very fat. To keep our teeth strong, look here. Should brush our teeth twice a day. Should go to the doctor. Shouldn't eat too much. Number one. Salem has fever. He, he should go to the doctor. Number two. Mike is very fat. He shouldn't eat too much. To keep our teeth strong, we should brush our teeth twice a day. Look, read, and circle. Kevin has got a stomach ache. He should or shouldn't eat apple pie. Number two. It's time to eat. The children should or shouldn't wash their hands with warm water and soup. Number three. It's raining today. Tony should or shouldn't ride his bike to school. Carrie has got a sore throat. She should or shouldn't have some tea with, with honey. Tony has got an earache. He should or shouldn't swim in the swimming pool. The children are sneezing. They should or shouldn't use a new tissue each time. Let's go back to number one. Kevin has got a stomach ache. He should or shouldn't eat apple pie. Perfect. He shouldn't. Number two. It's time to eat. The children should or shouldn't wash their hands with warm water and soap. Should. The children should wash their hands with warm water and soap. Number three. It's raining today. Tony shouldn't ride his bike to school. Number four. Carrie has got a sore throat. She should or shouldn't have some tea with honey. She should. Number five. Tony has got an earache. He should or shouldn't swim in the swimming pool. He shouldn't. Number six. The children are sneezing. They should or shouldn't use a new tissue each time. They should. You should and give advice in speaking. Look and write with should or shouldn't. Jack and Harold take umbrella. It's raining, so Jack and Harold should take an umbrella. He drink tea with honey. Brian has got a cough. He should drink tea with honey. He should, he should drink tea with honey. He shot. She used tissue and wash hands. Samantha wants to sneeze. She should use a tissue and wash her hands. She should use a tissue and wa wash her hands. Number four. Jamal has got an earache. He should take medicine. Thank you and goodbye my lovely students.